lease contracts we are going to talk about later. Uh, actually, the board has already approved the article to go in. Mm -hmm. You've approved the concept and, and yep. you've endorsed the article. So yeah. I would assume that the board would approve these two articles. Make a motion that we approve the two articles. Two police articles. Is there a second? I'll second. All those in favor? Yeah, I just would like oh. to say what the, I have the schedule here of what the right. amounts are. So these are for the sergeant police contract and the patrolman police mm -hmm. contract. So the tax effect for the 2019-39 weeks would be 21275 and for the patrolman police contract for 39 weeks would be 80204 Okay, so I would uh, just want to make those numbers, mm -hmm. and uh, yeah. I am ready to vote. The, uh, just so everybody knows, the first one is, is six-tenths of a cent, and the second one is 2.4 cents per thousand. We have a motion and second. All those in favor? Unanimous. And we should clarify for the public that the contracts begin on April 1st of each year. Yes. So if the first year is a nine month contract. Right. Um, you know, we've, we've talked before. Uh, we're now at that point where we have uh, signed a tentative agreement with the HPA. They're here for the board to officially approve that and move it to the warrant. Uh, I understand you already discussed that a little earlier. Uh, but to go over the TA, um, what we have is, <coughs> excuse me, several language changes, um, but the cost items are um, related to the insurance. Uh, the, there's been an agreement uh, to move from the, the prescription plan that they're on to another prescription plan. You'll recall um, this has been an issue that's been out there for a mm -hmm. period of time. Um, the plan that the HPA is currently on is no longer offered. The other unions have all moved to the new prescription plan. We're doing the same thing with the HPA that we've done with everybody else. Globally, that plan actually saves both parties, them and us, money. We've put a pool of money in there to help offset a transitional period, um, and uh, that's a, a cost item. Uh, the other issues are uh, details, the request to increase the detail pay. Uh, regular details now will move from, I think it's $35 to $40 or the officer's overtime rate, whichever is higher, and it's been an increase in the alcohol detail rate. So that is, if you work in a bar or a detail where there's alcohol served, there's an additional sum of money that's added. That's been increased as well to an $8 per hour additional for those. They're relatively infrequent, but they are situations where there is uh, mm. usually um, a higher risk Greater or risk. problem for the officers yeah. they're dealing with things. Correct. Yeah. Um, uh, with the wages, it's a three-year deal for 2.8, 2.8, 2.8. Mm -hmm. Within there also is an adjustment to the starting wage to the patrolman and an adjustment to the starting wage of the sergeant, so a first-year sergeant or first-year patrolman. Okay. There's been an adjustment in those wages. Patrolman, obviously, to be more competitive with some of the area or air, or the places we're around. With the mm -hmm. sergeants, we made an adjustment because there was a deficiency uh, in the prior contracts, the way things went, where there were circumstances where there was a sergeant supervisor who was making less money than a, yeah. a, a patrol officer that they were supervising. So we've corrected that to, to deal with that deficiency. Really, that's that's the extent of it. Uh, I'd be happy to answer any questions you have. Any questions from the board? Go ahead. I just want to say I was part of the uh, negotiations team this year, and I think it went really well. We had a couple back and forths, and... I think the assistant town manager did a very good job, and I'm it's glad. Good team. Yeah, good team on both sides. I hope that we can get this passed for our police department. It's very Agreed. important. I mean, when you talk about the increase in the detail, that the bar would be paying that, right? Correct. Those are private see. details that are paid by <coughs> outside folks. Right, yes. That's where that increase is coming. So that's correct. The yes. employer. Yeah. Picks up the tab. Any other questions? And we're talking two separate articles. One for the patrolman and one for the sergeant. Yes, and the changes are the same. There's just a different, in each of those two mm -hmm. contracts, there's a different article number that's yep. uh, identified in here. Yep. Uh, you costing items, uh, I understand you went through that earlier, so you're mm -hmm. aware of the costing items. Um, we've gone through that, you have the warrant article, so uh, I would ask the board to give us a vote. I made a motion that we um, accept the contract. Tentative agreements. Tentative agreements, yeah. Red for fine. both the, the patrolman and the sergeant chief. Yep, I'll second. All right, is that okay. yeah, that's a the vote to ratify. A vote to ratify, okay. So, all those in favor, four, 
unanimous. So we're taking the vote on both contracts. Correct. Just to Correct. clarify. Yep. And now that's another thing that we'll have Rick come in tomorrow to see if he can. So, yeah. yes. Okay. Okay. Perfect. 